Hello, welcome back. Um, today's video is going to actually be a tag. I kind of had an idea that I want to bring the old YouTube back. I know, obviously, I'm a very small creator, so it's not going to make any difference. But I just really wanted to bring all the old school videos back, which were tags and challenges, but like from back, way back when. So, everyone does autumn tag, but no one does a winter tag. So, in today's video, I'm going to be, it's called the Winter Wonderland tag. And I got this from a, late, um, a woman called Alison, I think her name is. And she did it like about four or five years ago. So, I thought I would do mine and I will do a tag. So, this makeup I did film, it is my Novena part two, um, like, look um i will link it in my description box below if you would like to see that but i'm just gonna dive right any part of this video where i don't actually have the product on me i'm just gonna put a video there or a photo there just to let you know what i'm just give you a, a visual preparation vis visual like representation of what it is for you so the first question is favorite thing about winter um my favorite thing about winter is probably not a lot because I hate the cold, it's absolutely freezing here in Northern Ireland. Um, obviously I work in retail so it's even worse. It gets really cold really easily. But all I do like is when I'm home and when I have a fire on and when Emma's home and we're just watching something like I'm a celebrity or some, something like that and having dinner together, it's just that coziness I think. And obviously Christmas, I really do enjoy Christmas as well. So yeah, that's what I enjoy about winter. Second question is scarves or beanies, and I am a scarves person. I don't wear beanies because I don't think they suit me. They don't look right on my head. Um, they just don't. I think I don't know. I think I have quite a big head, so they just pop off. Whereas Emma wears them and she rocks them all the time. So I'm the scarves lady. Uh, favorite Christmas movie? Well, I have actually been watching Christmas movies already. Um, I would say my favourite big Christmas film would probably be something like um, Love Actually or um, even Elf. But my favourite Christmas movies that are not as well known, that are more, I'd say like Hallmark, I think they are, is one is called Single Santa Seeking Mrs. Claus. That is beautiful, I love that film. And also, I mentioned in my November favourites is Broadcasting Christmas. So I really, really do like them food films. They are really like ones to watch. Um, question for favourite winter nail polish. Um, I don't really have a favourite winter nail polish. Um, I have started getting my nails done. I've not got them done recently because obviously I work in retail so they chip really easily. It's just a waste of money. But my favourite kind of colour is like a mauve burgundy, like ready colours. They're the sort of colours that I like to wear, but only on my toes, on my hands, I kind of try and keep it neutral just because you can never go wrong with a neutral fingernail, so that's for me. Um, my favourite Christmas Starbucks drink, which I am actually getting on Wednesday when we go to dairy, is a, just a hot chocolate, just a plain hot chocolate is my favourite drink. I love it. I, it's a perfect drink, especially for this time of year. Um, six. <sighs> Number six is, what is your three favourite winter essentials? Now, I'm not gonna say makeup because makeup in the winter isn't really a necessity um if it is it would be a mascara because i think it makes your eyes look massive and it just really helps in the winter to have nice um big eyes in the snow and stuff like that so i would say if it was makeup i would say mascara also lip balm is a definite product that you have to have what well, i have to have in winter because my lips get really cracked and dried really easily so i always have quite a few lip balms on me um also scarf things to keep you warm definitely an essential for winter so that. number seven night name one item on your christmas list my one item on my christmas list list this year is unfortunately the Jacqueline Hill um her entire brush collection it's a big one it is quite expensive but I am 
if I don't get it for Christmas, I will try and save up for it because it is that expensive. But no, I really would like that for Christmas. But if I don't get it, it's okay. It's just, it's just a thing. It's just, it's okay if I don't get it. Favourite Christmas song? Um, My favourite Christmas song is all of them. It's any single one of them. The one that makes me really think of Christmas is um, Wham! Uh, Last Christmas. I don't know why, it just reminds me of going Christmas shopping with my parents in the car and it being on, on the radio. So yeah, that really like sort of sends me back to my childhood. Number nine, did I go black Christmas shopping? No, I did not because I actually got paid before it. So I didn't have chance, I didn't have the time to do it. I was working on Black Friday as well. Um, over here, it's not as much of a big deal unless you go to Derry, which is like a long drive away and I haven't got time for that. Even online shopping, I didn't see many deals i kept getting emails from boohoo and they kept saying like up to 50 percent off so i was like oh my god let's have a look and then when it was on things that i put in my wish list it literally just gone down like three or two pounds so it wasn't it wasn't like a rush to get it it was just more of a it was just whatever to me anyway to me i wasn't that bothered um, number 10, my favourite, my must, sorry, my must have winter lip product is lip balm. You would think it would be like a liquid lip or a lipstick, it is actually just lip balm. I love lip balm, I think it is the best thing ever. That is my must have winter lip product. Number 11, will you be rocking a ugly Christmas jumper? Um, I want to, but the one that I've got, I don't like. It's, it was, I brought it back two years ago because I wanted to wear it, I wanted one basically, but it was from a market and it's not like the best Christmas jumper I've ever had. So I do want to get a new one. I just literally want to get a nice jumper, just a basic jumper that's got like some sort of Christmas print or something. And that's just cozy and lovely and Christmassy. I just can't seem to find anyone anywhere. They're all woolen. I don't want that. I want like, you know, like the LSE jumper. I want it that sort of stock like that. But, but I just can't find any anywhere. So it's just no point. So probably not, but I would like to. Number 12, have you ever had a white Christmas? Um, yes, but when I was very, very young, and I wouldn't call it a white Christmas because it was snowing, but it didn't lay very well. See, it always snows before and after Christmas, never on Christmas Day with me. So I'm really hoping this year it snows for Christmas. That would just make it lovely. And plus I might have the day off for the next day. You never know. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I probably won't. Um, number 30, my favourite Christmas, my favourite winter candle. Now, I'm going to put this in two parts because I have a favourite Christmas candle and a favourite winter candle. My favourite Christmas candle is, is called Red Apple Wreath. And I just feel like it smells like what I imagine an American Christmas to smell like. I don't know why. I think all the movies that I've watched, I just feel like that's what it would smell like. And my favourite winter candle is still home sweet home i know that's my autumn candle as well but it is still my favorite winter candle because it's same effect it's still, still the same like coziness and warmth and stuff like that so yeah they are my favorite candles for this time of year number 14 which is the last one is how will you be spent how will you be spending christmas this year this year i will be spending it with Emma's mum and dad we were staying around their house and spending it around there. So obviously go see the kids as well, see what they got, which I always look forward to, like I did last year. Um, and then Boxing Day back straight back to work, which is reality, unfortunately. So yeah, that is my Christmas tag. Um, I hope you have a lovely Christmas. I know it's quite a while yet. Well, it's like a good few weeks left until Christmas Day, but nevertheless i hope you have a lovely christmas and a lead up to christmas and i hope you all have a lovely day and always be safe outside i know this time of year it can be quite dangerous so please be safe and please look after yourself and i will see you in my next video bye